guys welcome back okay so it's time for me to open up my february boxy charm now i'm assuming this is the premium box because it's big for one and i actually have a subscription for the regular box and the premium box but this is the only one that has showed up so far so i'm gonna go ahead and open up this one which i believe is the premium yes it is <laughs> So when I open up my box, I see here that it does say BoxyCharm Premium. So let's go ahead and see what I got this month, okay? Very pretty pink with ribbons. Kind of looks like uh, flowers, but it looks like ribbons is on here. And yes, it does list all of my products right here on my card. Has some information about Boxy Pop-Up over here i guess some items that are going to be in pop-up but let's go ahead and see what i got in my box this month okay so this first item i'm pulling out very big tube here and this is from Coors. it's the guava body butter so this is what that looks like and let's see what it says here Coors body butter retails for 32 dollars this rich and luxurious body butter deeply softens, smooths, and nourishes the skin. Our Shea Butter Moisturizer is the perfect lotion for dry skin, helping to improve elasticity and smoothness. Okay, $32, huh? Let me open her up. So she did have a safety seal. Ooh, smells nice. That's what it looks like nice and thick i really like body butters they feel good yeah it feels very nice i guess it smells like guava i'm not familiar with the way guava smells but <laughs> it smells very nice and it feels very nourishing and moisturizing so very nice not mad at that okay so next i have here something from tarte it says Tarte Base Tape Double Duty Beauty. <laughs> so that's what the container looks like. Let me see what this is. Tarte Cosmetics Double Duty Beauty Base Tape Hydrating Primer. Retails for $30. Okay. Let's take a look at this $30 primer, okay? Oh, very cute. So that's what it looks like. Let me pump a little bit of this out. So it does have a little pump at the top. Okay. So it's like a white liquid primer. My hand is going to be real nicely moisturized and primed today. <laughs> and heavily scented because this has a slight scent of coconut. So let me see what it says about this. Retails for $30. Prep yourself before you perfect yourself. Turn up the base with this vegan coconut priming serum that hydrates your skin for 12 hours. This rich yet lightweight makeup magnet is infused with a blend of coconut and botanicals to help nourish and smooth skin's appearance. Okay. So it does fit. I mean, it, it just soaked right into my skin, even over that moisturizer. You can see. But yeah, I think the scent of the moisturizer is definitely stronger <laughs> than the coconut scent from here because I smell that guava. But ooh, it looks and feels nice. Okay. Not mad at it. Oh, by the way, guys, if you like my earrings, these are available at my girl DJ's Boutique. <laughs> I told you guys she has some really cute earrings, but I'll have her um, Boutique linked in the description box if you like them check it out okay so next i have here something from glow recipe this is a watermelon glow ultra fine mist okay so that's what the box looks like i love this watermelon stuff i like the smell of watermelon but it just feels really cool and refreshing on the skin as well oh this is cute look at that <laughs> very cute kind of looks like a little bullet or a little pill or something okay so let's see what it says about this watermelon glow ultra fine mist retails for 28 dollars 
Immerse skin into a hydrating mist so ultra fine and delicate and envelops your skin like a dreamy morning fog. This formula is packed with a juicy blend of 84% watermelon. That is a large percent of watermelon. Hyaluronic acid and hibiscus AHAs to refresh skin and enhance makeup. Okay, let me shake it up. Okay, you guys, let's check it out. Mmm, it smells good. Very, very refreshing. Am I glowing? <laughs> it looks like it did add a nice little glow to my face. Okay, so yeah, I like this. I'm probably gonna be spraying this stuff all over the place. <laughs> I like it a lot. Okay, next I have here this 24 karat gold foil moisturizer from what looks like Fascia, Fascia, Fascia see what it looks like oh okay fancy <laughs> you guys see how fancy this thing looks oh there my goodness. goodness okay let's see how much they claim and this is worth fascia skincare 24 karat gold foil moisturizer retails for a hundred dollars okay <laughs> The 24 karat gold foil moisturizer cream helps dry areas disappear without leaving behind a greasy residue. Its unique formula helps reduce the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles while firming, tightening, and locking moisture into the skin. That's some pretty serious claims. And for $100, this stuff better do that and then some. It's very, very pretty though. And it looks super duper thick. So I'm assuming you don't need much. So I'm gonna put some of this on my other hand <laughs> here. Okay. So that's what that's looking like. It feels good. Yeah, it feels really nice. It doesn't feel like anything special. It doesn't feel like $100. <laughs> <laughs> but I guess only time will tell since it's supposed to reduce fine lines and wrinkles. But yeah, so it soaked in my skin very easily, very nicely. It doesn't smell like anything to me. All I smell is guava and coconut. So, but this is very, very nice. Very bourgeoisie. Okay. Okay. Next, I have here something from Hourglass. This is the ambient lighting blush so let me open it up see what shade i got i have the shade diffused heat very pretty packaging nice and shiny and gold and this is what mine looks like very pretty let me go ahead and swatch this and that's what it's looking like swatched let me go ahead and just blend some out for you guys so you can see it on my skin tone. So, yeah, very, very faint, very light, very pale, if you can even see that at all. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, you know, what this would even look like on me. Mary... Maybe like a very, very pale pink blush, I would think. I would try some on my face, but as you can see, I'm blushed the house right now. <laughs> so it wouldn't make any sense for me to put this pale blush on top of this bold blush. But yeah, it's very, very faint. Very faint, but you can just barely see it right there. So let me see what it says about this. Hourglass Ambient Lighting Blush retails for $40. Discover a new way to blush. This groundbreaking hybrid combines the customized lighting effects of ambient lighting power with a spectrum of breathtakingly modern hues. The result is seamless, soft focus, and multi-dimensional color. Hmm. I don't know. I'll have to see. I'll have to put it on my face but if it looks like this on my arm that's what's gonna look like on my face <laughs> so I mean I was excited about this product because I thought it would be a little bit more glitzy a little bit more I don't know shimmery I guess but it's not so 
there's that. And lastly, I have one more item. This is the Picante eyeshadow palette from Carity. I did know that I was getting this actually because I believe I chose it if I'm not mistaken. I think this was uh, one of the items that I had to choose. So this is what the packaging looks like. Open her up. And this is what the palette looks like. So this is the Carity Picante. Let's see what it says. Retails for $29. Spice up your life. We've hand-selected 21 perfectly pigmented shades and multi-finishes that are as warm as a summer night. Packed with hot, fiery shades, sure to create endless looks. Perfect for day or night. Okay, let me swatch a couple of these. Now, I did have the, um, what was it, the Colorful Carity Palette? I don't remember what it was called, but it had all the bright colors in it. And I didn't really care for it. <laughs> I didn't feel like the quality was there. So um, I'm not one to really get all that excited about carity quality. But, you know, who knows? This one might be better. So that is a few of the shadows there. And here's a few more. So those are just some of the swatches from this palette. So it doesn't look that bad. I mean, it's not anything that's knocking my socks off, but only time will tell because I will be trying out this palette <laughs> and using it because it's a very big palette and it's nice and warm and it has some gorgeous shades in here. So, so that's it, you guys. That is my whole boxy premium box for the month of February. Like I said, whenever my base box comes, I will go ahead and open that for you guys so you can see what I got in there. But for this premium box, I'm pretty happy, actually. Everything I got, I can use. And so that's always a good thing. <laughs> you know, there's been a lot going on with these boxes and stuff and a lot of unhappy campers. So I'm glad that I have one I like. I did cancel my Ipsy. I just I couldn't with them anymore. I just had enough. So I did cancel Ipsy and I'm still kind of looking for a new box to replace them with, but nothing is that appealing to me. So if you guys want to drop a few box names, other than the, the regular, all the popular ones I've looked up and they just don't appeal to me. Maybe there's some I've never heard of though. So if you want, go ahead and drop them in the uh, comment section below and I will check them out. So thank you so much for hanging out with me. If you like this video, hit like, and I will see you on my next video. Toodles!